Hey everyone, happy Easter. It's Melissa Daniels here from Melissa Daniels Official. I hope that you've had some time off and I hope you've had an awesome weekend. But as we're coming to the end of a long weekend, it's the start of a new month, start of new goals and time to get really proactive. It's your last quarter of the financial year, so it's time to really kick some serious goals. So over my four days off, I've actually been doing some passive homework and watching what's been going on on social media and watching what you've been doing. What some of you are doing is business suicide. You need to stop it and you need to stop it right now. I'm all about you having sales and I'm all about you having Easter promotions and things like that. They can last a day or two. They can't last for a month. You are chopping your knees off and you are going to go broke. I know that there's not enough... There's not enough profit in what we all do for you to cut prices by 50 to 70%. It's just ludicrous and it means you don't understand your business. It means that you're in panic mode and it means that you're showing to your clients that you're desperate. So you're going to attract clients that one are bargain hunters and really don't give a hoot about you or your business. They're never going to be loyal. They're there because it lines their pockets that they get a service. It also means that within the next month or two, by the end of financial year, you're going to be struggling and wondering what the hell is going on, and it's because you've chopped your knees off right now. If you're in business and you don't get your bottom line, this is it's business suicide, and it scares the hell out of me watching you people do it. Okay, so I know some of you in my community are watching and listening and trying to learn and things like that, and I get that. I still make mistakes too, so no one's perfect, but my first go-to point when business is down isn't to drop my prices or isn't to value add beyond what's comparable as far as the dollars are concerned. Some of you are offering 50 to 70% off. As a one day thing, you can afford that and you can afford it to get leads in and to get clients in there and to give them a bonus because everyone wants a bonus on a long weekend. I get that. But when you're carrying the deal for a whole month, you have to stop it and you can turn it off now before massive amounts of clients see it. It will send you broke, literally and quickly. So within the whole health and beauty industry, I know the margins and I know the marginal price ups. So for you to be able to knock 50 to 70% off and do it long term makes no sense at all. You are actually one, devaluating how incredible you are and what great services you're offering. You will then start offering shitty services because you can't keep up with the demand of the people that want to suck your blood and you are going to go broke in a busy salon. It's going to look like you have a busy salon or a busy business or a busy, busy weight loss business and really you're working for nothing. You're trying to pay staff on nothing. You're trying to pay the rent on nothing and it, was, it looked like a great promotion and a great hit wonder now but long term it's going to chop your knees off. So I've been watching some of you over the weekend and some of the sales that you are doing are ludicrous. You are killing yourself. And it frightens me and scares me. When I have slow times in the business, and everyone does, I totally get that. Price chopping is never my option. It's always an option of finding something better to give the clients and something to make the clients stay longer and something to make the clients love you and respect you more and get rid of the bargain hunters. I don't want bargain hunters in my shop. I'm prepared to offer my clients awesome service and awesome results, but I don't want them just to be there because they got 70% off. That means I'm not getting paid, it means my staff aren't getting paid, and it means having bums on seats is just taking away from good quality clients. You've got the shitty clients there on the shitty money and you're not going to go anywhere. So for those of you that are watching, I hope that this will hit a nerve with you. It's not that I'm having a go at you. It is so that I'm out to protect you and look after you. After riding the ups and downs of being in the health and beauty industry for 30 years, I know that this is detrimental. There are way better ways to go around doing what you're doing and increasing turnover, increasing clients and getting cash flow happening right now. And it could be a one day sale of doing something amazing, but not something that's going to last a whole month, especially some of the ones that I've seen are offering services that are going to last two or three months and you're chopping your knees off by 70% for two or three months. Do the maths. It's not going to work. You have to pay you to be there. You have to pay clients to be there. You have to pay your staff to be there. You have to still continue to advertise to get new bums on seats. You have to be able to fit your regulars in on those bums on seats. And you need to be able to be making a profit by this time at the end of June. You've got three months left of this year to smash it out. 
don't kill yourself and do business suicide by offering things that are way beyond what you can afford to do. So I know that you think that you're doing the right thing, totally get that, totally here in your corner, and that's what I'm here to help you with. So I'm offering this week, I'm going really hard this week and offering free calls, and these are free strategy sessions. So this means that we can have a one-on-one -on -one and I can talk to you about what's going on in your business and show you ways around getting around discounting. Hi Louise, how are you going? Discounting 50 to 70%. There's no profit in 50 to 70% off, okay? You're working for 30%, which isn't even gonna cover any of your overheads. So seriously, this week, let's get stuck into it. It's a new month. We've got three months left to bang it out and make this year a good year. And if it's not your greatest year, let's set you up for the bigger, better year next year that you're already in the learning process this year to know what to do better for next year. So free strategy calls. I am doing some salon visits this week as well, where I'm actually gonna come in and tweak you and help and show you better and bigger ways to grow your business. And I'm really looking forward to working with you. But those of you that have got ads up this weekend that are 50 to 70% off and are lasting longer than tomorrow, please take them down and please let's have a chat and see if there's something else that we can do to make your business bigger and better. Enjoy the rest of your day off and I'll talk to you through the week. Bye.